All right, now as soon as we uh, boot, you can see that um, no sound or anything like that. So you want to see the hard drive. You have to go to the preference and set up the preference. So just like on the video here. All right, set up the trackpad um, to make sure that we can click. So drag in if you like and um, adjust the speed. All right, to your liking. So I would um, drag the application folder uh, to the taskbar for easy access. So I'm going to drag the um, post apps with all the apps and the kecks through the desktop so I can uh, install. I'm going to copy all the uh, apps that I need into the application folder. So I'll just drag them over. So now I want to use the um, Kex Helper um, to install the Kex to the partition. So the Kex are um, Fake SMC, um, generic USB 3.0, the PS2 from um, Rehab Man, um, Ethernet, uh, also from Rehab Man. Um, so, whatever the sound, uh, I use Voodoo, okay? The next one is uh, Clover. I want to install Clover. Now, on the external USB hard drive, when you pro, uh, partition to um, GUID partition, they will have a hidden EFI folder. So what we're going to do is we're going to, oh, right now uh, we need to go and um, uncheck the uh, permission for uh, different apps onto uh, the system okay so while we're there we do the firewall also I forgot about that so I just turn on a stealth mode mode and um, So let's install this. So the version right now I use is 3.021. Now uh, we're going to customize it and we only install uh, for UEFI booting only. And make sure you check the uh, RC. So I'm not a savvy uh, Clover guys. So I just gonna use whatever works for me. Okay. So look at the um, driver or the uh, EFI that I use and it will work. Um, So while we're waiting for the Clover to install, uh, I use, I also change the um, shortcut for screen capture. Uh, I use Control Three instead, and Control Four for the area.
back to Clover. If you notice, it's finished. And uh, on the right hand side, you see the EFI folder or partition. That one is actually from the external USB hard drive. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna open Clover and copy the config file, the CAX, the uh, patch, uh, SSDT or and uh, DSDT over to the EFI Clover uh, folder. All right. Okay. So after uh, installing the um, the sound, now I can record with the sound. Okay generate SSDT uh, for this laptop so follow the instruction from uh, Pika Alpha SSDT PRG EN dot SH so do exactly like this okay open and then copy this line Right, and then we will download it for you. Okay, so you do that. It's gonna download. See that? And then you gotta change mode. C H M O D plus X. Uh, S S D T P R G. And SSH SSDT P R E G N G N dot SH. All right, so look at this, it detected um, the U. I7 4510U also is really good. 15 watts only. Frequency is base is 2 gig to 3100. So do you want to copy the extra? I don't have any extra folder, so I said no. I don't need to open SSDT either. Okay, so we need to go and get that one. Oh, the library was hidden. So to see the library, you need to go to show view and click on the show library. Now show it, okay? So now it's open. Go to SSDT, open this one, and that's the one we're gonna copy into the EFI. So we're going to copy this. And we're going to put it in here. Clover. ACPI. Patch. Out to V. So we have one. So after we put the SSDT, uh, now we can see the frequency is moving and also the power fluctuating. And just start and see if it go up to 3 gig or not. And I go to 2.5, that's it. 2.4, 2.48. But look at here. 51 feet per second, that's pretty good. 64. Just a test. Look at this. It dropped down right away. That's pretty good. Um, 
this one is a voodoo. 8.4, uh, 2.8.4. Installed a D link um, external USB wireless. So now I can connect with the internet. The important thing is that IO registry, it will look for um, EN0, which is the uh, internal um, Realtek 8168, and EN1 is now the um, the external. So it's very good. I'm going to replace the uh, internal um, combo card with a Broadcom or the Ethereal okay, for uh, Bluetooth and internet Wi-Fi. So now everything seems to be okay uh, I'm going to restore this one into window but I have to make a partition first this about this mag so MacBook Air 13 inch mid 2013 okay and system report Audio. So this one is not auto uh, detect like the IDT. So I have to uh, make this one so that it will do that. Um, the Bluetooth, there's none. Cameras there. Car reader is none. Ethernet is there. Graphic display, so it's 0816 for the 4400. Four, um, fully uh, accelerated. So, one thing is that the battery doesn't work because I haven't patched it yet. 